All right, we are on a roll, fellas. This is gonna be a smash hit for Big Willie. Gosh dang, this is gonna be good. Hooray! So, 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 so what are some other fun things we can say about Miami? How about this? Bouncing in the club where the heat is on. Hot dancing, love it. Yep, what else we got? Water so clear you can see to the bottom. $100,000 cars, everybody got them. That's gonna get people partying. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, and I was thinking of another thing where he could be like, ain't no surprise in the club to see Sly Stallone, Miami, my second home. What was that? Miami, my second home. No, the other part, I don't really know what you meant by that. You said something about Sly Stallone, I think? Yeah, yeah, that's, I was just thinking, like, it, when you're in the club in Miami, it, it wouldn't be a surprise to see actor Sylvester Stallone in there with you. That's kind of specific, man. I think the idea is more like, hey, here are some fun general things about Miami. Are you suggesting the Italian stallion doesn't party sometimes? Cause he does. He might, but- He's got a freaking house in Miami. I read that in Architectural Digest. Okay. It's just, this song's kind of a list of fun things about Miami, right? Yeah. So I feel like if we end that list with, hey, you might run into 51 year old actor Sylvester Stallone in a nightclub, people are gonna think we ran out of ideas for the list. Technically, the last line would be about Miami being Will Smith's second home, though. So you also want to end with the idea that Will Smith himself isn't there most of the time. And that it'd be no surprise to run into the star of Rambo 3 at a South Beach nightclub. That's right. But like, does he go out to South Beach nightclubs so much that we want to immortalize in a song how unsurprising it would be to see him in one? If you saw Academy Award nominee Sylvester Gardenzio Stallone in a nightclub while on a weekend trip to Miami, you'd feel nothing, and we need to put that in the song. Oh my God. Okay, look, you don't need to get angry, okay? We'll put it in the song. It's a, it's a very good lyric that you came up with. It's just, I know his dad is the head of the company and whatnot, but sometimes I'm forced to say yes to these ideas that don't make any sense. It's like, you know what? He was actually right. I don't feel a thing about that. <laughs>